Hello. Hello, everyone. How are you? Good evening. Hello, good evening, Amber. How are you today? Hi, Mauricio. Hi. How are you today? How do you feel? Uh, tired. I am sick, teacher. It's insane. All right, very good. A little bit tired or? How was your day? ¿Cómo estuvo el día? How was your day and your weekend? Y su fin de semana largo, creo. <laughs> Le dieron, tuvieron libre el, el, el primero de mayo. Sí, dije, no en mi caso sí, pero he estado un poco mal de salud. Oh, me imagino. I'm sorry about that. He estado con gripe hasta ayer que lo ve más o menos recuperarme. Oh, entiendo. I'm sorry. No fue un fin de semana entonces tan tan divertido como pudiera haber sido <ríe> por Labor Day. Sí, he estado tirado en cama prácticamente. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry for you. Hi Jacqueline Gloribel. I think she's getting connected. <coughs> oh my god thank you very much hablando de gripe <laughs> all right hi glory bell hi good how evening good evening how are you today cansado tired. you say tired 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 is he bien cansado sería exhausted como exhausta Exhausted, exhausted, cansada, o oh, exhausta, mm -hmm. exhausted. No, pero you look tired, so cansado, nada más, tired. <laughs> Hi, Oscar. Hi, teacher. How are How you today? You? Oh, nice, very good. Thank you very much. Really? Okay, so we are about to start. Estamos a punto de iniciar, so it's just one minute. Yeah, it's 8-1 already. So um, let me pass the attendance quickly in one minute, okay? Les pasaré asistencia rápidamente en un minuto, in one minute, okay? So please get ready. All right. Okay. Para los demás, ¿cómo estuvo el fin de semana? I'm sorry about Amber. How was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? How was your weekend? Pretty good. Not bad. How was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo el fin de semana? How was your weekend? <laughs> My God, you're so quiet today. Very good, teacher. Oh, nice. Very good, Mr. Gabarrete. Yes. <clears throat> Ok, so I will pass attendance quickly. Le voy a pasar asistencia rápidamente para que empecemos. So we start with the class. All right, let's see. Um, oh, let me see here. Yeah, I have it here. All right, let's see. Um, Ana Abigail. Ana Beatriz. Present, teacher. All right. Welcome, Ana Beatriz. Bienvenida. Welcome. Carlos David is not connected, right? Hello. Edgar Alexander. Is okay, Amber Giovanni. I'm here. All right. Hey, Cesarai. Oh, okay, very good. Thank you. Jacqueline is it? Not connected. And Jorge. No, Jorge Adias, no lo veo. Jorge Aquino. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos is not connected yet. All right. Ya veo a Edgar ahorita ahí también. I see Edgar. Eunice. She's not connected yet. María Elena. Mauricio. Mauricio. 
Are you saw Mauricio? Present. Ah, okay, yeah, he's connected. Nelson? I'm here, teacher. All right, Nestor? I'm here, teacher. All right, Oscar? Present, present. Okay, Roxana? Se me ha conectado Roxana. Wendy, Natalie? Jacqueline Gloribel. Present. All right. Jocelyn Joanna. Not connected yet. And Jesenia Marisol. Not yet, right? Oh, no. All right, perfect. So, uh, so we have to start. Vamos a empezar la clase entonces. Let's start the, the class. And well, for today's class, as always, we have like a variety of, of activities, but before, we go to unit number four. Um, let's try to remember, okay? Let's try to recall. What did you study the last week? Tell me some things you studied the last week. What did you study the last week, la semana pasada? What did you study? Estudiamos. Let's try to refresh a little. Reflejemos un poco. Yes? So, so the question is, what did you study last week? ¿Qué estudiamos la semana pasada? Uh, presente continuo. We studied present continuous. For how many purposes? ¿Cuántos propósitos? How many purposes? For? For three purposes, right? What is one purpose of the present continuous? ¿Cuál es un propósito? Del presente continuo. Tell me one purpose of the present continuous. One purpose is for the future, for the future, para el futuro. For example, when I say um, I'm organizing meetings tomorrow, for example, future, right? Present continuous for future purposes. What about the other um, purpose? Otro propósito? Tell me another purpose, please. Another purpose of the present continuous. Otro propósito del presente continuo? Tell me another purpose, please. I'm sorry, teacher. Estamos haciendo. Sorry? Para decir algo que estemos haciendo. Exactly, exactly. It's, it's for actions in the moment. It's for actions in the moment. For example, you can say, uh, the teacher is asking questions in this moment, okay? Or the teacher is asking about the topic in this moment, or Amber is participating in this moment, okay? So actions in the moment, yes. So we have two purposes. Purpose number, no, purpose number one is for the future. Purpose number two is for actions in this moment. Para acciones en este momento. And the third purpose, el tercer propósito, what about the third purpose? Is the last thing we studied. Es el último que estudiamos. Is the last purpose we studied. El futuro. Yeah, yeah. We mentioned the future. Future and actions in this moment. And what about the other purpose? El otro propósito, what about the other purpose? I will give you a clue. We use the expression these days. These days. Estos días. We use the expression these days. So what is the other purpose? ¿Cuál es el otro propósito? What is the other purpose? So I will give you one example then. Les daré un ejemplo entonces. Um, I am working at Inglés Corporativo these days. I am working at Inglés Corporativo these days. So what is the purpose? ¿Cuál es el propósito? Um, these days. These days. And what is these days? Estos días. Estos días. So is a, is a, is a... At this moment. No, no, no. It's not, it's not, it's, yeah, yeah. At this moment, exactly. It's at the moment, okay? Uh, at this mo at the moment we can say or is a temporary a temporary situation remember ah. 
Y es a temporary va a terminar situation. pronto. Ajá, es una acción temporal o es una actividad temporal, una situación temporal. For example, you say, ah, we are studying English at Inglés Corporativo these days. That's not permanent. Eso no es permanente. That's not permanent. Okay, so it's temporary. So we use the present continuous for temporary situation, situaciones temporales, okay? Y usamos these days. Remember that. Recuerden eso. Si we use these days, all right? So, um, I can say for actions in the moment, um, Nestor is paying attention right now. Actions in this moment. Acciones en este momento. Um, Eunice is connecting to Zoom right now. Okay. Yes, she's connecting right now. All right. So, I can say... Um, Edgar is listening to the class in this moment. So this moment, in este momento. So actions in this moment, all right? But now I can say, um, I am going, I am going to a school tomorrow. It's future. Estamos usando el presente continuo para futuro, for future. I am going to a school tomorrow. Or I can say, you are working tomorrow. Yes, you are working tomorrow, or maybe I can say, um, what? Uh, Loida is going to a school tomorrow, for example, or Amber is driving, Amber is driving tomorrow. So it's future, it's futuro. Amber is driving tomorrow, yes, the car. Or a temporary situation, una situación temporal. Okay, so in one temporary situation is, you are studying English, at Inglés Corporativo these days is temporary. It's not forever. No es para siempre. It's not forever, okay? It's only for a period of time. Solo por un periodo de tiempo. It's only for a period of time, okay? So do you have any question before we go to, to the next? Oh, Oscar. I can see you have a question. Oscar? Teacher, it's temporary. Finally, is my camera. <laughs> so your ten, your camera is failing. Yeah, that's temporary. <laughs> I I <Yes>. think <laughs> I like the example. I will tell him. I like the example very much. I'm sorry about it's that. It's really. Yeah, I know it's real. I'm sorry about that, and I'm sorry about that. <laughs> All right. So Oscar Adnulfo's camera is having problems. Uh, in this moment, all right? So it's, a, it's an action in the moment. Es una acción en el momento. It's an action in, the, in this moment, okay? Very good. Uh, so three purposes for the present continuous. Tres propósitos para el presente continuo. 